What is going on YouTube? The Assist Man. I'm coming back at you guys with another Neverwinter video. Inside of this Neverwinter video, the gameplay you're going to be watching is me just queuing for a random intermediate queue and getting this throne of dwarving gods just terrible dungeon. But I got it and I played it and that's what you're going to be watching. So what I want to go into this video, man, is I want to talk about what is going on or what happened or the future changes we might see with double refinement stones and two times refinement stones events. So if this video helps you in any way, shape, or form and you do enjoy it, man, please do not forget to hit the thumbs up like button on this video. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. It's Saturday, man. I hope you guys have been having a good weekend so far. Maybe a good Friday in Neverwinter. Last night, I hosted an amazing um, dragon flight in my alliance where we did 10 dragon flights, man. Had a great turnout in my guild and a great turnout in my alliance, man. And afterwards, I gave away a ton of stuff to people in my alliance. I gave away a rank 14 brutal enchantment. Shout out to the guy who unlocked boxes anonymous that won that. I gave away a mist form purple mount. I gave away a couple of UESs. I just gave away a bunch of stuff. Just, you know, trying to trying to give back to the community as much as I can. But I had a good time. That's what I did last night in Neverwinter. We host some dragon flights uh, on Friday nights in my guild for, you know, our obviously my guild and our alliance. So shout out to everybody in my alliance and thank you guys a lot for the Dragonflight runs last night. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this topic at hand though, man. I've had a bunch of people in the past couple days ask me, in the game, in my guild, in the comments, yo, what happened to the two times refining stones event? Because on Xbox, I can't speak to any other platform, but on Xbox, there was supposed to be a two times refining stone event that was supposed to be taking place right now. It was like on the 24th of January, it was supposed to start. And then it just like mysteriously vanished from the calendar of events. I mean, it just vanished. Like David Copperfield just came in the game and put the curtain down. I was like, ha, ah, gotcha. And it was just gone. I was like, where, where, where did it go? I don't know. It vanished and there is no two times enchantment refining stone event. No two times refining on Xbox right now. And then when you go to look at the calendar, there's not one coming up at all. Like the calendar runs to like, I think like the end of March or something like that. And it's not a two times refining stone event anywhere on the calendar at all. And a lot of people ask me, yo, do you know what happened? Are they taking it out of the game? Are they putting it back? And I'm here to tell you, I have no damn clue. I'm just as clueless as you guys, but I do, I do have some some theories you know i am one of those theory crafters out there and i do have some theories so let's go into theory number one theory number one is maybe they just accidentally took it off the calendar because you see the thing about neverwinter is that they can adjust make changes add or remove things to the event calendar at any time like they could just do it like all the time if they wanted to and when this mod first dropped like the day before there was like nothing on the calendar and then when the mod dropped there was a bunch of stuff on the calendar and then now some stuff has disappeared so they could just change stuff whenever they want so theory number one is maybe they didn't mean to have it this weekend and when they realized that they took it off which would kind of be bad because it's already on there so you should leave it on there especially if you got players looking forward to it and it's on there so that could be theory number one or they just like i said maybe it just got accidentally removed who knows? But like I said, there is no more two times enchantment stone events on the calendar at all for like the next two months. So that's kind of weird too. Or that takes me into theory number two. And I think this one might be a little bit more plausible, guys. Maybe they are doing away and taking two times refining stone events out of the game. I mean, there's no secret that this game is taking away a lot of stuff from the players over the past couple of months and mods. I mean, a, a lot of players tell me all the time. They leave comments on my videos. They tell me all the time in game that this game, every single mod just finds a way to take more away from the players to try to get you to spend more money. Maybe it's true. Don't know. You know, the way I feel about this stuff, I've already covered that in the past, but it could be true, but maybe they are taking two times refinement stones events completely away from the game because you have to look at it from this aspect. 
is that there's way too much refinement in the game right now. I mean, there's a ton. A, a, an absolute ton. If you're an end game player right now, you're just like giving away refinement. Like, I give most of my refinement away to my guildmates, or I put it in the guild bank. Like, I don't need refinement. I, I Like, when you're end game, which a lot of people are end game in this game, because most people that play this game have just been playing it for a while. And there's not like a, a you know, a big array of new players coming to this game. So, there's a lot of refinement, especially in Mod 15 now. It's like, you get so much more refinement in this mod now. I mean, because now you can't salvage stuff anymore. So, all your purple stuff, you can either donate it to your guild coffer, or you can use it for refinement. Then you get tons of refinement that just drops in dungeons. You get tons of refinement that just comes from end dungeon chests, with all the rerolls, and all that stuff. So, there's just too much refinement in the game right now. I mean, damn, like, rank 8 enchantments, rank 8 enchantments are selling on the auction house for like 1,200 AD each. That's nuts. That's nuts. There's just too many of them. You're getting tons of refinement now in all the new lockboxes. Ever since they went to the new lockbox method now, they're just filled with refinements. And by the way, I think the new lockboxes, the past two of them, are just terrible. And I barely even open any of them. But that's, you know, for another story. But yeah, they're just filled with refinement. There's just too much refinement in this game. And maybe they said, ah, you know, there's too much refinement in the game. And they don't need, we don't need to do two times refining events anymore. That could be another theory. Or another theory is maybe they've learned from some kind of mistake. And what I mean by that is that we all know that during two, or most of us know, that during two times enchantment events, it's the easiest way of making money. Because all you have to do if you're an endgame player, or any, you don't even have to be endgame, if you're any kind of player that could do Cradle of the Death God, you just go farm Cradle of the Death God for two days straight. And then you just get a bunch of UESs, and every time you get an ultimate enchanting stone, now instead of you getting one, you get two. And then now you got the brand new thing when you could reworld the chest. It's almost like a damn guarantee that you're going to walk away from every single cradle run with at least two ultimate enchanting stones. A lot of people have been walking away with four of them. Because now you could just re-roll ten times with two chests. And if you get an ultimate enchanting stone in the first chest and you get an ultimate enchanting stone in the second chest, those are now doubled. So now you get four ultimate enchanting stones. And I don't know if you guys keep your, you know, your ear to the ground, but... The, price of, the prices of ultimate enchanting stones, from what I've heard on PC, plummeted because of this. Plummeted. I heard that, I mean, I don't know if this is true, and obviously some of you guys will, will say in the comment section of this video, but I heard that on PC, at some point, ultimate enchanting stones were selling for like 30 or 40,000 AD each. That's insane. Because I remember ultimate enchanting stones on Xbox just like two and a half, three months ago were selling for like 180,000 each. Now already Ultimate Enchanting Stones, damn, before this mod came out, Ultimate Enchanting Stones on Xbox were selling for around 100 to 120,000 each. Now on Xbox, you can pick them up for 70,000 each, 65,000 each. So imagine they would have brought in a two times enchantment stone event right now with all the chest rerolls and everything. Man, can you imagine how many damn Ultimate Enchanting Stones would be on the auction house? The supply would be much higher than the demand. Freaking Ultimate Enchanting Stones would probably be down to 30,000 on Xbox as well, too. So maybe they learned from their mistakes and they didn't want to kill the economy. I mean, that could be another theory. But I guess it's up to you guys. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Me, personally, this is what I know. Two times Enchantment Stones were supposed to be on Xbox. It was on the calendar for a while. It mysteriously vanished. It's not in the game. It's also not on the calendar anymore for the next couple months. They have said nothing about it. And my theory, what I think is going to happen, is they're going to completely do away from the two times enchanting stone event because there's too much refinement in this game right now. And they're going to rework the entire event and bring us something different in the future. Which is good and bad for multitudes of reasons. But I just still think it's kind of weird that the two times enchantment stone event just completely diminished. It's just disintegrated off the calendar. I don't know where it went, but leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about everything I just said. Did you even know that the two times enchantment stone event just vanished and it's supposed to be going on right now on Xbox? Do you feel like they're not going to bring it back and they're going to take it out of the game now because it's not on the calendar anymore? Or do you think it was just a mistake? 
Do you think that, like, it just was not supposed to be taken away and they're going to bring it back maybe next week? And who knows? Leave a comment down below because I don't know as well. So anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. You guys know I always say in my videos, man, I'm currently always recruiting for my guild at all times. We're currently Guild Hall 12. We don't have max boons. But we are very active, very helpful, and we're always looking for very active and helpful players at the same time. So if any of you guys are ever wanting to join my guild or join a new guild, just make sure you leave a comment down below, let me know what's up, or message me in game, or message me on Xbox Live. If you guys ever do want to join my guild, the doors are always open for anybody. As long as you meet the requirements, you have to be 13,000 minimum item level. You have to be helpful. You have to be willing to donate. You have to be cool with us not having maxed boons. And you have to be, number one, most importantly, active. Because our guild name is the Allegiance of Active Players. So come join us if you ever want to. Inside of this dungeon, as you can see, it's finally over. I don't even know why I wasted so many re-roll things on this on these chests. I shouldn't have even wasted all my re-rolls on these things. But I was really just trying to get a plus five ring so I could use for guild marks. But I didn't get it. I, I, I re-rolled both of these chests so many times it got absolutely nothing. But, you know, a bunch of refinement and, you know, some rough AD. But hey, it is what it is. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you did, please go ahead and don't forget to hit the thumbs up like button. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well. So YouTube, this is the assist man. And until next time, I am out.